right, it's Wednesday. Lucy Greer here on a Greer's Wednesday. Mm -hmm. um, we request this recipe. <laughs> more than almost any other. And it is perfect for this time of year. You can have it with coffee, you can have it after dinner, you can just have it <laughs> all day long. Pumpkin bread. Yes, it is so good. And um, Posey says, my grandmother. That well, anything you love. Posey says, I, I believe. I know. She says it's the best she's ever had. So okay. <laughs> I translate that as it's the best just in the world. <laughs> this so, is the best one. Yes, and it's so easy to put together. And I thought we'd start off with our dry, I yeah. mean, our wet ingredients. Okay. And I have four eggs in this bowl. And I'm going to add one can of pure pumpkin puree and like. You know, I always mention it's not the pumpkin pie filling, it's just the 100% pumpkin in a can. So just one can of this. And then we're going to add three quarters of a cup of vegetable oil. And then a couple of teaspoons of vanilla extract. So that's all our wet stuff that yeah. we'll just get together in this bowl. So I see, are we going to put a little topping on this too? Yes, that is actually the best part about this bread. We're gonna do a little streusel topping and um, that's gonna be some brown sugar and some flour and the pumpkin pie spice and some melted butter. Mm -hmm. So as soon as we get the batter mixed up, we'll sprinkle that on top and then you bake it. So that kind of takes it to the next level here. So we're just gonna mix this you know, until it's combined and then later we'll put together the dry ingredients. Yeah, and again, all this month we, we like to think about everything pumpkin, pumpkin, but even going into November, as you yeah. get ready for the holidays, this is a great thing to take over to someone's house. Like if you're going over for a party as a little hostess gift, you can bring yes. one of these along. Yeah, that's such a great idea. And this recipe actually makes two loaves. Oh, perfect. So that is um, it's definitely a great idea to take to people. And and um, it's just so nice this time of year as we're getting into and um, people are just, you know, always having parties and get-togethers mm -hmm. and things are going on. So it's always nice to, to take somebody something that you made. Yeah. And um, now with this, I know cook times vary with these different bread recipes. So what are we looking at so everyone can be prepared? That's a really good point. If you're, um, so as far as temperature, we'll talk first. So the recipe, the instructions say 350. Okay. But if your pans like this are dark then you're going to take it down to 325 okay um, but some people's aren't dark so if they are 325 and then it's going to take about 30 minutes to bake so not too long and then when um, then when we take it out of the oven we'll just let it cool on some cooling racks um, in the pan and then we sprayed it with this nonstick um, spray here mm -hmm. so they'll just pop right out uh -huh. so 30 minutes 350 but if your pans are dark 325 easy to do mm -hmm. and that's the best part also about Greer's when you go into the store everything is there especially if you go into the store where there's an ace hardware if you need something for the house yeah maybe a new rake because yeah. the leaves are starting to fall <laughs> getting into November you can get all that stuff there yes exactly so we try to make everything the most convenient that we can for everybody and um, we love our private label that I always use on this yeah. store best choice um, just as good as the national brands and saving you some money too and also still doing pickup grocery pickup mm-hmm yep greers.com slash shop and that'll give you all the information for curbside store pickup mm -hmm. or also the delivery options too. Yeah. So you can pick it up at the store or get it delivered. I have a feeling this is one of those recipes I'm going to print out, which by the way, I have done for almost two months straight now with your yeah. recipe. So I, I recommend you go print them out as well. You can find them on fox10tv.com. You can find them on the Greer's website as well. Yes, and um, my Facebook page, Lucy Greer, I'll post stuff and um, keep everybody updated with what's going on at Greer's and the kiddos. Uh, she also, yeah, I was about to say, she posts really cute yeah. pictures of the kiddos. That's reason <laughs> enough to go ahead and like her page. We're gonna continue to work on the pumpkin bread here in the kitchen.